Hey Kingdom family, my name is Candy Nicole and welcome back to Arise in Glory. I know this is ratchet and if you come from my other channel, you know I used to come on here with some little hair stars, I would try to make it look cute, but this is just straight up ratchet. I'm in the middle of braiding my hair, but God is giving me a word for y'all. So come and get this word, all right? So basically, this started earlier today. Bernice, if you are watching, this word is for you, but this word is not just for you. It's for the entire body of Christ because right now, God is calling many of his children to do things for him and his glory. He's calling many of you to start businesses. He's telling you to write books. He's telling you to do a whole bunch of different things and some of you are fearful of doing those things you're scared it's going to fail you have tried before but god is saying that this is a season of favor abundant favor and the things that failed before this time it will be different so do what he's telling you to do so earlier today i began hearing i i got work to do i got work baby I got a job, baby. I got work to do, y'all. So you have work to do. That's how God started this off, okay? Then he's telling me this. Proverbs 18, 16. A man's gifts makes room for him and brings him before great men. God has instilled things in you from when he created you. And those things make you great. Each one of us have a talent and a gift, a reason why we are here and needed on this earth. And God is telling you it is time to do those things. Whatever it is that he has pointed out to you to do in this season, there's an urgency to this. You need to stop the delay, remove the distractions, and get to work on what it is that he has told you to do. So God highlighted to me next. I'm looking for it because I have stuff written down. Um, what was the other song? He was just singing. Oh, he said this. If you really, really want it, all you got to do is get up on it. If you really want it, baby. So if you really want it, all you need to do is get up on it. And you got work to do. It's time to do this work. All right. Matthew 25 verses 14 talks about the parable of the talents. And as you guys know, in this verse, the owner, property owner, entrusts his property to these guys. Okay. Each one of them, he gives a different amount to. Each one of them, except one goes out and he adds more to what it is that the master has given to him but this one guy he afraid he afraid he gonna lose out he afraid he gonna lose the master money so what he do <laughs> he basically go take it he go bury it and when the master returns everybody is bringing the stuff to him like master man i doubled up the money for you i doubled up the money for you everybody like doubled it up when they come the next his turn He's standing there. He was like, I was scared. So, you know, I, I'm going to give you back what you gave me. And he was like, you wicked servant. And God is basically saying, he done put things up in you to do. It's time for you to get out there and make it happen. It's time for you to double up. It's time for you to flip it. Okay? He done put the talent in you. But now it's time for you to get out there and do what he said for you to do. If you just start, he will bless it. You got to start though. You can't just sit there and be in fear. You have to step out of your comfort zone and try something new. I hope you guys are having a wonderful day. Sorry about my um, appearance. Also about my interpretation of scripture. Please go read this for yourself. It is in Matthew 25. Verses 14 through 30. Go read it for yourself because that was that was a very hood version right there. But you understand what I'm trying to say. It's time to get to work. I hope y'all are having a wonderful day and I'll talk to you soon. Bye.